It's full of food. But, but how do they get it in there? people have asked me about how to do canning. Uh, I, I have a very simple method. A lot of people make it out to be this big thing and it's really not that big of a deal. For some foods it's a little bit more complicated, but for some it's really easy. One of the easy ones is marinara sauce, uh, just to regular tomato sauce. Um, what I'm going to be doing today is uh, canning just one in here. Normally you would want to fill up a pot just for efficiency, but you can just do one, one jar at a time. Uh, so this jar right here is just a regular jar I got at the store. It had Newman salsa in it. Uh, I also use real, you know, quote unquote professional canning jars. I don't know if professional is the right word, but like actual canning jars. And those are better in a lot of ways, but you can, you can use these. And I've been able to reuse the lids on these multiple times without them failing. As long as it pops, it's sealed. So uh, I'm going to use this, but I have a special helper to help me fill this thing up. We're going to use a funnel. Hey, there it is. Okay. So I'm going to use a funnel. I'd highly recommend using a funnel when you do this because you want to keep the top surface all nice and clean so you get a good seal with your lid. Here, River, can you fill it up? There you go. Now, River's going to be putting in ladles of this marinara sauce very carefully. Uh, and the, the goal is to get the level of it to be just about an inch, maybe three quarters of an inch below the top uh, surface of the glass of the jar. And the reason for that is you want to create uh, some pressure uh, when the, the gas at the top um, shrinks as it cools, and that's what really keeps your seal in there. So you want to have some air space at the top. Okay, that looks like that might be good. Let's put the ladle back in here. Shake that flat. Yeah, we need just a little bit more. You want to put just a little bit more in there? Maybe more than that. Yeah, again, like I said, it, it doesn't have to be exact, but you want air up there. You don't want yeah, more than an inch, but like an inch or less. Somewhere between a half an inch and an inch should do pretty well. That looks pretty good to me. That's, that's actually pretty perfect right there. So we're going we're gonna to do it like that. We're going to take, take this lid, and you want to make sure this top surface is nice and clean. Same with the lid. Nice and clean. Put it on, give it a good squeeze, and put it in a pot of water. Here's a little separator. Keep it off the bottom. Put that in there, fill it up so that the water level just, well, we're not actually going to fill it up here, but we're just talking about it. You're going to fill it up so the water level just covers the thing, put a lid on it, boil it for 30 or 40 minutes, and you're done. It's really not that big of a deal. When it's all set, I really recommend getting one of these, and you can kind of use that your jars out. Normally you would fill this up, but uh, you don't have to, uh, just it's more efficient and you, you don't have to heat up as much uh, extra water in the sides. So that's it. It's very simple to do. There's other foods like with meat and things like that uh, that can be more complicated. Uh, things with a higher pH, yeah, a higher pH, um, you, need, you get it, have to get into pressure canners and all that kind of stuff. But for acidic foods like pasta sauce, you just have to boil it in water 30-40 minutes. And like I said, if it keeps the seal on the top, it's good. Although, as insurance, what I always do is when I pull this stuff out of canning, I never eat it until I've, I've cooked it anyway. For botulism, if you heat it for about um, uh, five minutes, you have it boiling for five minutes, even if it got botulism, the five minutes of boiling would destroy all the, um, the toxins in there. So, that's it. I'm not Try canning. It's very easy. What do you want to say? I'm acting like, because I like this. Oh, wow. You're a thespian. You like, marinara, you like marinara sauce when it's on noodles, remember last time? I, I'm, I'm oh, you're just acting. Wow. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video.